Hello, welcome to this demo of the Augment plugin for 3ds Max. I'm going to show you quickly how to export a 3D model from 3ds Max to Augment with the script. So, I've got a 3D model here. It is a fairly simple 3D model. It is, uh, well, it's rather heavy for mobile. Um, we can do something about that and I want to export it. So let's first optimize this a bit um, because uh, this is really a little bit too heavy for my phone and I think this is good enough as well. So, uh, optimizing your uh, objects is uh, something you have to check out on a, uh, uh, with every model. Uh, this might not be the same, but, but in my case I could easily uh, reduce the mesh while still keeping uh, good quality, especially when I'm going to look at it on my phone. So let's open the script. Here it is. Um, this script will uh, bake textures and upload stuff to uh, the Augment platform to your own account. For this you need to uh, get your API key uh, from your Augment account and fill it in here. And after that you're good to go. So let's just try this out. Um, fill in a name. There are some product options. Uh, you can add a description or other stuff. You can make it private or public. Uh, I'll keep this one private for now. Um, and you can set this, uh, you can change this anytime on the Augment platform as well. There are no transparencies here. I'm going to bake a draft settings. So let's do this. Select the objects, name, and publish. It's going to check my uh, my web connection, uh, see if the file has been saved, and it's going to unwrap it, auto unwrap. So that's uh, uh, well, yeah, yeah. What you see is what you get, and then it's going to bake it. Uh, every object is going to be baked. You can also decide to uh, collapse the uh, the object before baking. I'm going to let it run out here, so you see uh, that it's. Uh, well, it's not especially fast, but it's uh, it's good enough. This is Mental Ray. Uh, the um, system supports Scanline, Mental Ray, and V-Ray, and um, it uh, supports uh, Max up to 2014, and I think it starts at 2010. I'm not sure if 2009 is supported. Uh, I think not, actually. So we're we've baked. Now I'm going to uh, do nothing and let the script handle the map channels. Um, he's going to make a screenshot, uh, export it, and now it's going to upload. As you can see, 700 kilobytes. After uploading, uh, the augment site is going to process the model and show me um, a web page. So I'm doing nothing here. This is all automatic. And now I can scan the QR code with my um, Augment app and watch it. And that's actually it. So from here to online to my telephone or other, other device in just a few clicks. Okay, happy uploading.